So tick-tock indeed, it's time for semi-final number two. Eli Dershowitz from the USA, the world number 13, takes on Aaron Silagi from Hungary, the world number two. Luigi Martellotti takes control of the fight. And straight away, Dershowitz. few times there, block, and at that time, changing up the order, stepping into the middle. I say an easy one, he made it look easy. Long attack fouls from the Hungarian. Oh, just goes low, he did all the hard work there, collecting the blade, the picking up the right of way. Say, coach, a little disappointed with that one. Oh, attack failed from uh, Zilagi, but he's so quick. Time. Tried one of his late power pass this time. Martellotti just trying to keep uh, the American in check. Call for the video, but I think that was more about giving himself some thinking time. So no video appeals for uh, Dershowitz left. Times like it's Dershowitz that steals the right of way. Nice, that is a beauty of a hit. So the attack failed from Dershowitz. Reactions from the American. Again, that hop open on a start from Dershowitz is not working. Zalagi too fast, goes into the break with an 8 4 lead. Looking in control, but Dershowitz showed signs perhaps. So Laggy season has seen him win uh, a Grand Prix in Orléans, a World Cup in Budapest at home. He didn't compete in the individual European Championships a few Sol weeks Grand ago. Prix a little bit later on in the season after winning in Orléans in December. The world title holder. Second period of the second semi-final in the men's sabre competition. And Silagi off the mark straight away. Again, these get out of the way and try and lure Zilagi into finishing. Oh, he's just got to get off the line faster. Just like that. Showed the referee to give the attack. Well, the line came out again from Zilagi. Is there a hesitation? No, Martellotti gives that. Loses that appeal. Just one light on the box there for the American. You know, Dershowitz was the first uh, USA man. In the crowd here to support Zilagi. So too much movement with the blade that way, but look how much Eli Dershowitz has closed this one up. Nice from uh, Zilagi stepping out of distance on the long attack. <laughs> Haven't seen so many of those since the very beginning of Another one. 
So Dershowitz has burned. gone to Zlaggy, had it gone to the video. Zlaggy trying to lure out the attack to find his yeah, power riposte. Right. Couldn't land one of his masterful power riposte. Now it's Dershowitz with the right of way. Back within two again. Next hit is critical. Dershowitz a little fast over off the line. I think his first attack failed that time. But it's lagging not fast enough. A critical moment in the match, this one now. Again, misses the first one, but hits with a remise. He knows he's got lucky twice there, Eli Dershowitz. A little bit more concerned than he was earlier on. This is a tight call. I slightly favour Zilagi, but uh, Messi seems uh, convinced it's Zilagi's hit. And in fact, it's been given preparation, Zilagi. And the attack goes to Dershowitz. What a time to take the lead for the first time in the semi-final of the men's sabre competition. On the attack and he lands it. Eli Dershowitz from the United States of America has turned this men's semi-final on its head. He was miles behind. But the silver medalist from Wushu 2018 is going on to compete in the final here in Milan. Guaranteed at least a silver medal. He'll face Sandro Bazadze of Georgia. But what grit, what 